video demonstration, I'm going to show you how to make quite a simple card using the new John Nextdoor Salvin panel. Now this panel comes in two parts. So you get the beautiful sort of perfect circle, and that is a perfect circle in the center with the circle sort of knotting all the way around. Then you get the outside die to go with it in case you want to sort of set it off or frame it or something like this where you just cut it, but you framed it and then paper pieced back in or you can do a beautiful offset. So I've done three colours here just to offset it, or it will extend to give you an entire background. But we're just gonna make a simple card with this one today. So I've taken a piece of coconut white essential card here, and I've just cut this to five inches by five inches. And I've already stamped on a sentiment in a light gray. And I'm simply going to take the panel die and I'm going to put it around down two sides so i'm leaving a strip about half an inch and i'm using my board to tell me and then i'm just simply going to tape that down really quite simple and we're just going to run that through and die cut that so i'm going to die cut that while we're doing it and while that's going i'm going to bring in here i've got a card blank i've already made so this is a simple six by six and I've put a matte and layer of white on it and a little bit of clotted cream. And I've got a simple piece of clotted cream to go at the back, which is cut exactly to the same size at five inches by five inches. So I'm gonna peel the die off and you can see it cuts in, but not out. So it gives us this really beautiful, simple pattern. And this just works so, so well for really simple, beautiful cards. So we're going to use a little bit of foam tape. And the reason we left that quarter inch on one side is so we've got enough room to add some foam tape onto there. So I'm going to support both sides of the panel. And then going to support the other side. And we're just going to add a couple of little pieces either side. I've got one in the middle there. We'll just grab a little bit for there. Just like that. So again, we're going to just reveal our tape. I'm using two millimeter foam tape, which gives me the depth I want without being too deep. And again, makes it really easy for postage. So this is quite a flat card. This would be a standard letter to post. You wouldn't have to worry about it being a large letter with the depth. I'm then going to take the piece of clotted cream and I'm just going to match that up. It's easier to do it from the back. Put that down. And there we have that simple little pattern running through there. I'm going to take a little bit of glue. I'm just using the Craft Artist glue and glue that straight on flat to our card blank. Really simple really easy but beautifully effective i think and then i've just got three little flowers these are the marigolds and these have just been cut in clotted cream peach and beige and i'm going to pop those around the sentiment really simple little collection and there we go a very simple yet easy card to make. You could cut this straight into the card blank, put another colour on the back. There's an awful lot you can do and achieve with this die, but sometimes we just want a really quick card.